Good morning, I'm Earth Dr. Reese Halter, and you're listening to EarthCast, SOS.com. The Arctic is broiling. It's at least two times hotter than any other region on the globe. Between 1998 and 2017, the Arctic lost 17% of its ice along shallow continental shelves, vital nurseries for sea ice to reach the central Arctic Ocean and Fram Strait. That's the passage between Greenland and the Norwegian archipelago Svalbard. This loss of ice being transported in the Arctic region is yet another deadly blow to polar bears, walruses, and sea ice algae that overwinters underneath the ice and supplies an essential food source for krill, whale, seals, and seabird food. As if this weren't awful news enough, yeah, rising Arctic air temperatures are now driving changes across the entire ecosystem. Hotter temperatures are impacting forest and tundra growing seasons, increasing wildfires, boosting rain and snowfall, and melting sea ice. It's shifting the region from its 20th century condition into an unprecedented state. April reached a new record low sea ice extent at 5.19 million square miles or 89,000 square miles below April of 2016. Infuriatingly, the United States dismissed climate change at the recent Arctic summit. Instead, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo said melting sea ice brings new opportunities for trade. Well, I gather if you're in the oil and gas and shipping businesses where subsidies are rife, you'd be glad. As for the rest of the planet, it's an emergency runaway climate. It's up to each of us to lend a helping hand, consume less, switch to a plant-based diet. Please, double please, vote for elected officials who will protect citizens from the climate crisis, not fossil fuel oligarchs. Hashtag resist. Hashtag extinction rebellion. Hashtag love is the solution. Hashtag love nature. Earthcast SOS depends upon you, the listeners, so don't be shy. Come on to Dr. Reese. Dot com, D-R-R-E-S-E dot com. Click on those donate buttons to make more Earthcasts happen. Have a Captain Cook, which rhymes with look in the library. It's rich with information. And while you're there, pick yourself up any number of splendid books on bees, trees, seas, wild weather, life, the wonder of it all, save nature now, and my latest book, Love Nature. Just do it. Dr. Reese. Dot com. I'm Earth Dr. Reese Halter, reminding you to protect our planet.